I know that this little red bleaking light here doesn't mean anything because I've already paid for parking in this zone, but dang it, it makes me anxious. Anyone? I am in downtown Dallas right now, headed to Weekend Coffee to meet a good friend of mine, Rob Novoa and his wife, L'Oreal Novoa. Together they run Novoa Photography. They're super talented photographers. And then on top of that, they take most of the photos for Tacos and Tunes, and Rob is a killer videographer. So we're just gonna run around downtown Dallas and uh, see what's up. for the vlog. So this is Rob and L'Oreal. We're gonna be hanging out today. Rob is actually making a vlog today. The whole concept is about just gear, what you can do with what you have. I'm gonna kind of film what he's doing so you guys can see like the behind the scenes of that. I have a lot of friends who are saying like, hey, I wanna get into this. I wanna do some vlogging myself. Uh, and you guys can see what it takes and uh, how shameless you have to be in all of the public areas. Uh, as we are right now. Yeah, as we are right now. We have found something sneaky in our table. What? It doesn't serve a purpose. What is the purpose of this? If anyone knows what this is for, comment. Yeah, now we're just <laughs> checking all of them. <laughs> it's like it would make sense if they had like plugs or something down there. There's know? nothing under there. Oh, oh, there is a plug. <gasps> it's a plug. <laughs> oh, she's lost. <laughs> we are going to find a cool location so I can do my intro for the video. So as you can see, I know a lot of times when you're watching these videos, it looks like someone just walks into the room and they set their bags down and they sit in front of the camera and the camera's been going the whole time. I think we all subconsciously know, hey, that camera was set up ahead of time, but I honestly, when I'm watching these things, I don't think about that because the number one thing that's key in these videos is story. Uh, you can't just sit down in front of a camera and start talking for 20 or 30 minutes. I mean, you can, but it's a lot harder to watch. There's no pacing to the video. And so what Rob is doing right now, and one of the biggest components when it comes to vlogging, it doesn't have to do with your camera, it doesn't have to do with whether you've got a $100 phone camera or an $8,000 Canon. Uh, it really has to do with like, man, do you have the guts to go out, set the camera up, walk away from it, walk in the frame, and not worry about the people walking around you looking at you like, dude, what is this guy doing? So we just shot right over here. I just said, hey, no one's gonna know if I move 10 feet that way. <laughs> They'll think it's a different location. <laughs> Which is important in the storytelling because you want the video to have a timeline and even though it's just 25 feet apart it just feels like you're somewhere new so pro tip sponsored please sponsor me please not sponsored but sponsored for <laughs> yes. So I feel like it kind of goes without mentioning, but I should say number one rule of vlogging or of doing anything like this is just ask permission. People ask me all the time, like, man, so people don't mind you walking in and filming and stuff like that. I just ask, hey, do you mind if I film a little bit of this for my vlog? They might ask you what it's for, uh, but they don't feel uncomfortable that way. I love, love, love filming coffee shops. But the first one we were at today, it was really crowded. There were a lot of people in there and I didn't want to make all of them uncomfortable, even though the shop itself was fine with us filming. The second shop we were in today, Honestly, I've been there a lot of times. I always ask them if I can film. They always say yes. Today, it was a different group of people and they said, hey, security might ask you to leave. Uh, I think they're cracking down on that. So just ask, hey, do you mind if I film in here? They might say, yeah, no filming allowed. And you can save yourself the embarrassment of getting told that in the middle of one of your shots when you already feel a little vulnerable. Uh, or they might say like, heck yeah, we don't care. Here's my tag on Instagram and let me know. Uh, but make sure you just kind of keep that in mind with people. So what's going on, man? <laughs> it's good. Perfect. Do you want me to try to set it up again for the video? Oh my god! <laughs> Another big rule of vlogging that Rob will tell you, get gear insurance because he likes doing stuff like this. It literally gives me a heart attack. 
has been a really good day of just walking around the city. Let's stop in the shade for a minute because that feels good. Hopefully it was super helpful for you to see Rob and kind of how he's piecing this vlog together so you can see kind of what goes into it. Honestly, you don't need these big fancy cameras if you want to start one. A cell phone will do it. The most important thing is story. So I mean like it doesn't matter if you're filming this on a Nokia phone if they have a camera. On your Samsung Razer or whatever the thing is. You know what I mean? Anything with a camera it'll work. I've seen terribly shot vlogs. This one included sometimes. They're still fun to watch just because there's a story and because there's pace and a lot of the tips and the tricks and the stuff that you saw Rob doing today was that on top of that his footage is just killer. So I was thinking to myself when the last time that we even had a freaking taco on this vlog. This place behind us, El Tisoncito. El Tisoncito. Sergio and Victoria who are really good friends of ours. They've been on the vlog. Victoria's going to be on a really great one coming up here. They turned us on to this place. It's freaking delicious. They've got awesome micheladas. They've got phenomenal tacos. We're going to go eat and drink both of those things. Bye, Rob. I hope the vlog is good. Will it be ready by Tuesday? It will most likely. You heard it here, guys. It'll definitely be ready by Tuesday. Ready by and Monday. it's definitely at the link in our bio.